I recently did a short on Starlink satellites and about how one to two of them are burned up in the outer atmosphere every single day. And while they don't really pose a risk to you as a person on the ground, they look really cool burning up in the sky if you ever get to see one, sort of like a, a shooting star. But I think a bigger conversation starts to come in with what happens to the materials in the outer atmosphere and how do they affect us on the ground. Now, for most of human history, we haven't been sending things up into our lower, middle, and higher atmospheres. And what happens there is actually crucially important to life on Earth. Scientists have begun opening the conversation to what happens when a compound like aluminium oxide, which is created on re-entry, what does that do to our outer atmosphere? And this is actually a very reactive compound. It, they found it actually bonding to ozone particles, which might create problems in the ozone layer. It also contributes to heating in the outer atmosphere, specifically above the poles of our planet. Now, while this conversation is still very, very small, I think it's worth it that we start thinking about the things that we send up and bring back and what happens in that path in between because it might not just be a matter of well we send it up and bring it back down it might actually be harming people in other countries all around the world and possibly our entire ecosystem